Hello everybody, I am Mike DeZorch and uh, I'm here to talk to you today about a tragedy that happened uh, the other day in Japan at the offices of Kyoto Animation. Kyoto Animation is one of the most celebrated Japanese anime studios since Studio Ghibli. They've responsible for Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, Clan Ad, Kaon, uh, the Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya. They're they're responsible for some of the most most celebrated, most iconic Japanese anime productions ever. And in a malicious act, an arsonist set fire to the building with people inside it. Um, he was allegedly yelling, um, die, when he spread gasoline around the studio and set it afire. Latest reports put the death toll in the studio at 30, and it's a terrible tragedy for people the families of the victims, the people who are who have survived this this tragedy, for the the company that has brought a lot of joy to people, a lot of joy to 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 fans of their work all around the world, not just in Japan but here in the U.S. as well and in Europe. And this was just just a horrific act. I mean, just because just because they make anime and they make some really really good anime they make some of the best and you know it is right now it is not clear if Kyoto Animation will recover from this if there will even be a Kyoto Animation when this is over and so we have to look towards the recovery of those who are left behind. Those who um, need medical attention because of this tragedy. And I'm going to put the link in the description below to a GoFundMe campaign started by Sentai Filmworks here in Texas. And they they set this up immediately, immediately after the tragedy happened. They created a GoFundMe campaign to help um, the survivors pay for their medical expenses and for their fam and uh, to assist their families. And since its creation, since it wasn't that created that long ago, since its creation, it's already made a million dollars, which is wonderful. Uh, if there's if there's one thing that I know about this community, the anime community, if there's anything I know about them, from being a part of this community, it is we are wonderful people. We're not monsters. We are not weirdos, like what the mainstream wants to call us. When things like this happen, when tragedies happen when there are people in need we come together like no like few other groups do we come together we rally together to help people to either help members of our own community or or help others close to us we come together we've done it before and this is just another example of that and you know I don't know what the motivations were for this person for doing what they did. I I I don't know. Um if if what I know about uh Japanese law, case law, um how previous um cases of arson with um where people have died are are, are handled this person is basically going on death row. They they handle they handle arson extremely seriously there. 
um, mainly because a fire is an extremely dangerous thing in Japan because you know in a lot of places especially in Tokyo buildings are very close together and any major fire could easily spread and there could be huge loss of life because of that so setting what this person did not only harmed the people in the Kyoto Animation Studio he could have inadvertently harmed a lot of other people in the surrounding area um, so again it's taken extremely seriously but that's not what this video is about it's not about trying to demonize this guy I don't know what his motivations are nothing nothing that can be said can justify what was done what we need to focus on more is helping those who survive helping the, the victims and their families so again I am putting in the description below the link to Sentai Filmworks' GoFundMe campaign to assist the survivors and their families. Because this is a great community. We are, we really come together when people need us, when people need help. It's either when they're members of our community or someone in the industry. We, we've come together to do this before, to, to help. And... I know a lot of other, um, a lot of other people in the um, anime YouTube community have made videos about this before. Uh, I know Lost. I just watched um, Lost Pauses uh, video, Joey's video on this, which is sort of what inspired me to do this video. Um, not because I'm copying him, but because every person that gets the word out helps so if you're able to give a little bit no matter how much go to the gofundme campaign and and donate what you can every little bit will go towards helping the victims and their families from this 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 truly terrible tragedy they Kyoto Animation has given us so much joy over the years. It it this is our opportunity to give back. They've they brought us a lot of joy over the years. It's time for us to help them. I've been Mike Desorch, and thanks for watching.